In this video, I'll show you how to add uh, furniture and other uh, plumbing components inside your project. So as you can see over here in my bathroom and in my laundry, I've got these um, uh, certain um, elements that I have. So a sink, my basin, um, and then my shower as well. So to do that, it's very simple. What you have to do is you go to component, um, and then place component and as you can see I've got say this dishwasher which has been loaded um, but usually if you don't have that uh, if you don't have the component that you uh, the specific component that you're looking for what you would do is you would um, you press on escape and then you click on edit type and then let's we would load the, the particular family so we would go to um, let's say for in the case of plumbing click on plumbing go to architectural fixtures and then bathtubs and i can i can um, i can load any of these bathtubs um, again if i click on sinks and i can load um, any of these sinks um, and if i what else do I have? There's other as well. So if I go back to mechanical and I click on fixtures, and over here I've got more options. So my water closet, um, I can have any of these water closets loaded up. Again, what else? My showers. Um, so say i wanted this shower store which is rectangular i click on open and click on ok and then as you can see now i can place it um and assume that i wanted to place it somewhere here now the shape if i want to rotate it what i can do is i can press my uh, space bar on my keyboard in order to rotate the shape so press once you see how it rotated press another time and now i'm able to place it say on the towards the edge of the of my wall um again notice how when i place that when i place that specific component since it's a plumbing um it's a plumbing fixture i've got these two um, outwards if you like and these connect your water pipelines so you gotta always make sure that these two outlets are towards the outer side so they're facing the wall and because the pipes are going to be somewhere in that in that wall so what I basically mean is that you can't have these two outlets on the other side because you won't have any pipelines um, at this at this end of the fixture so these so one way of making sure that the component has been placed correctly is to make sure that these two um, outlets are at the are facing the side of the wall. Now again, if I wanted to place, say, you know, other 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 elements. So if I go at a type and I go load. Um, so let's say maybe furniture um tables I mean I wanted to say place this type dining table click on open again and then wait for it to load and click on OK you can see I can place my table somewhere here now if I wanted to play with the settings um or with the specific type I can select it and i can go to edit type and i can pick the length and the width i can also specify the material so that's how you basically add furniture and other plumbing fixtures um, into your revit project